Hey guys, about seven months ago, I released a tutorial how to make consistent characters in mid journey. This tutorial received 120,000 views and that was seven months ago. Now until today, if you're an illustration book creator to create consistent characters, you had to do a lot of different hacks and basically try to use mid journey in a way it was never intended to be used. But two days ago, mid journey six released a new feature targeting specifically the making of consistent characters in mid journey. I'm not going to waste your time and jump right into the prompt. Now, just two days ago, mid journey six released a new feature, which comes as a keyword called CRAF or character reference. First, make sure you're using mid journey six in this drop down here in settings. Okay, so once you make sure you are running mid journey six, what you want to do is start your prompt as usual. Imagine prompt. I'm just going to use a basic example Mickey Mouse running in the rain. Now let's go to Google and find a good reference image. It can be an illustration character for your book or even a photo. Now let's just say it's this image. So what you want to do is right click and go to copy image address. Now let's go back to mid journey. So at the end of your prompt here, you want to type dash dash C ref, which is the new feature and it stands for character reference. And now what you want to do is simply paste your URL of that Mickey Mouse picture. Now this feature is also controlled by a second keyword dash dash CW. And basically it goes from zero to hundred. When you have it at zero, only the face of your character is going to remain consistent. This is good for changing different details like clothing or hairstyle, but keep the face as consistent as possible. Now, if you want all elements to remain as consistent as possible, you're going to set the CW to 100. It's going to be less creative, which means most of the features of the character will remain as consistent as possible. And finally, in case you didn't know, you can use dash dash R10 to create 10 different generations in a row instead of calling this prompt by hand all the time. 